the Zeppelin. There have been lots of previous airships, but the most successful of all time, the Zeppelin, was ready for takeoff in the year 1900. It was named after its German inventor, Ferdinand von Zeppelin. In 1928, Germany used Zeppelins for the first transatlantic passenger flights, in a time when passenger airplanes couldn't fly that far. These Zeppelins were considered the cruise ships of the sky. Why? Well, compared to the way we fly nowadays, you could wander across the airship, watch the world pass in panoramic view, sleep in your private cabin, float in the air, causing zero pollution, and land vertically, which means you could land anywhere. But of all the gases, the Germans used hydrogen, which burns very easily to fill their zeppelins. They floated perfectly, like bombs. In 1937, something horrible happened. A zeppelin called the Hindenburg exploded. The way the media described it, didn't go unnoticed and soon there was little left of the Zeppelin's reputation. On top of that, World War II came by and wiped out the last remaining Zeppelins. They were never really to return again. So next time when you're flying in an airplane, think of the Zeppelin, an alternative which offers more than just transportation.